Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to Raft. No, that is not Balboa Island. Before I go to Balboa Island, I want a few things. Because I seem to remember it being very dangerous, also very large as well. So the things that I want begin with armor. Because you never know when one of those bears is going to jump out of the woods and attack you. I do seem to remember how to fight them, but if they get the jump on you, it can be a problem. So I want to be able to take some hits. Another thing I want is I want the uh, backpack so I can extend my inventory. Now I got plenty of leather for both of them. And of course, there's some leather walking on the shore over there. What I don't have is wool. And you get wool from shearing llamas. So I have to capture a llama, hold it, and then shear it every once in a while in order to get the wool off of it. So now that the boat has been finalized in terms of its size, I have been able to do some construction. Like I said, I made this room over here, probably do some farming in here, probably keep bees in here. Who knows? I might put some other stuff in here as well. Uh, it certainly does have a good view. Yeah, I didn't put any windows here because I don't want to look at the boat. I want to look at the ocean because the ocean is beautiful. It's just dangerous, although not as dangerous as it once was. Oh, and I did put some more trees down, of course. So that way I can have wood on the fly. I can always put another one there, another one there. And then once, uh, I can actually put one there too, because I don't have to move the antennae as well. So I can have lots of wood. Of course, once this was done, I was able to construct a habitat for our little friends. And I do believe if my count is right, there are 14 plots of grass. I can actually make six more. And of course, this island is going to have a cave, which will get me some more. What is that? Oh, is that a goat? All right, I was really hoping that there would be a llama over there. All right, if there's no llama, then I'm going to... Well, I'm going to grab the goat. I'm going to grab the goat because I want a goat as well. It's just that it means I'm going to have to go someplace else looking for a llama. I think there can be two creatures over there other than the boar. So we're going to have to see. I'm going to avoid the other side of the island. One, because there's no creature spawns over there. And two, yeah, there's this creature. And I just don't want to deal with this creature if I don't have to deal with this creature. Now, here's the thing. I do have the net launcher. I was looking for ammunition for it and I realized, oh, there's a reason I don't have ammunition for it. So I took the, um, the goo, what was the name of it already? The explosive goo, and of course, I cooked it in the smelters. Uh, I do believe I have to research it now in order to get access to the net canister. All right, that's the one that has the net in it, and it's going to explode, and it's going to capture our friend, and then we're going to carry them back, and we're going to put them in their new home. All right, so now let me see. What do I need? It's a weapon. It's over here. Okay, oh, I left it in the uh, bench there, didn't I? Yes, I did. All right, so I got six of those. What else did I need? Stones and rope. Those are two things I have a lot of. Okay, I'm actually quite happy that I have something to do with these stones now because I had so many of them. And rope? Rope is absolutely not a problem. I just have rope going crazy here. Actually, put that one back because I need space. All right, let's see. How many can we make? I guess six. Yep, there we go. We got six. All right, so let's put this back. And we just saw the loading animation there, didn't we? Um, and yeah, I do have some fish to turn in. And I have some trash cubes as well. Because I want to work on getting to the next level of uh, reputation in regards to the trader. I don't think that's going to happen today. But I do need to get some more bait because, as you can see, I did do... Uh, I got rid of the eight that I had. All right, let me get the... Um this over here. I also do need some water. So let's do that. All right. Obviously, the first thing we're going to have to do is handle the individual on the beach. Now, if he would just come down here and pretend that he can actually attack us, that'd be great. Here, can you hit your hair? I just missed that. That was my fault here. Let me just try again. Oh. Now, I'm just wasting arrows at this point. The thing is, he's going to be immediately able to detect then I'm here.
Okay, I think one more should do the job. No, nope, I was wrong. Ow, ow. There, now he's dead. And I do believe I lost some arrows there. At least he's laying still. All right, how many did I lose? I lost four arrows. Are they sticking out of the ground? Yeah, I was shooting when I really shouldn't have been. Oh, well, I can get more. All right, it is nighttime, but let's just go over here. Okay, first of all, we got the goat. Hold on a second. Is it just him? All right, well, one problem at a time. Oh, and I don't really have enough space for that right now uh, because there's a box up there. All right, first things first. Let's uh, sell the uh, the fish that I have here. All right, and then the net nibblers, and then the uh, sharp carp. All right, closing in, but nowhere near enough. All right, so how many of these can I buy? I can buy five. All right, I have uh, six cubes left, and I do believe I have the maximum amount, so I need to do a lot of fishing. All right. I think we're probably going to have to grab him. Um, I don't need that. I don't need that. I'm just seeing it now here for a second. Grab that. Okay, that's some good stuff. Uh, do I have any space left? Palm leaf. I don't need palm leaf. Oh, but I did see that there was a good tree over there that I could chop down. The thing is, I would never be able to carry everything. All right, so I have to go back. Hi, how are you doing? I should have had the gun out for that, shouldn't I? All right. This way. This way. Gotcha. Hi, how you doing? I have a new home for you. It was so uh, nice of you to run right towards me. It tells me you just really wanted to be at sea, you know? I mean, goats just have an anchoring for the sea, don't you? Get the joke? Anchoring? Um, there's a lot of food for you to munch on. And you're going to get milked on a regular basis. I know you're going to enjoy that. You're not, you're not a male, are you? Because I think you might enjoy it too much then. And I don't think that would work too well in the juicer, just saying. All right, and up we go, and down we go. All right, of course, I did not name him because I am counting on my viewers to help me with that. There's lots of food there for you to eat. So let's just go on back here. I need to drop stuff off here because I got some interesting things here, including I got another head. Yeah, once I have the uh, the biofuel thing going, the heads are very useful. I just realized there was an extra head in there, and I have no idea why. All right, so put them in there. And, okay, I need to put stuff in here now. All right, so I have 23 of the trade coins. And now I have 20 bait. I'm going to have to do a lot of fishing. Um, I think I leave the leather over here. Yeah, I mean, I have enough leather to make the armor in the backpack. It's just the wool. All right, now I have some good things over here. Like a bolt and, of course, that. Is there anything else? I mean, I can put the scrap there for now. Oh, the meat. That's right. And I need to go to the cave so that I can get more. I got a lot of meat there. I have been living off of uh, vegetable stew, by the way. Usually what happens is that when I open up a barrel and it has like one vegetable in it, I usually come over here and I'll get three from here and then I'll just make vegetable stew. That's kind of the reason you see the bowls in my inventory right there. Oh, and I have been doing juicing, by the way, for the people who tell me you should juice. But understand, that does wear down a battery. Just saying. As a matter of fact, all those cubes basically wore down this battery. Oh, I got another trash cube there. And uh, I actually have a ton of stuff loaded in there. Mostly plastic. All right, put that back. Put that in there. I don't need that in there. Okay, we're going we're gonna to take a trip. We may hit a few. I want to hit the cave. Oh, oh, I'm going to hit the cave, but I don't have my shovel. I need to have my shovel. We're going to keep our eyes open. There might be another animal. Oh, you know what? It's dark. Let's not do this in the dark. I have a hammock. If I don't see a, uh, a llama, we're just going to go to another island. And, uh, well, I'll say I'll go to another island, and then we will rejoin when I have arrived. Hold on a second here. 
Alright, that'll do. Alright. Fortunately, unlike the bears, the boar does not respawn. You just have to remember that you didn't kill him, right? Alright. I don't see any more animals. Sometimes there could be another animal in the area. Oh, uh, pineapples. I'll take pineapples. I just don't want the seeds, that's all. Yeah, I'm going to have to go to another island. It's unfortunate, but that's just the way it is. Uh, because even if I could um, capture this creature, I wouldn't want to. All right, you know what I want to do? I want to finish... I want to finish this axe off. Yeah, I have a bunch of... Um, trees of my own right now, so I don't really have to worry too much about that. thing is, I don't want to get in his range and stand still, if you know what I mean. Because that's just asking for trouble, especially considering I can't see up. Okay, um... Is he diving for a rock? No, he's not. Alright, I need to go in the cave. Is this the cave? No, the cave's over this way. Which, unfortunately, is closer to him. No, actually, it is over here. It is over here. But it is close to him. Yep, 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 this is it. And, unfortunately, one part of it is open. So, I'm just going to work my way over here. Alright, we got some uh, mushrooms. We got some mushrooms. We got some mushrooms. And then, of course, we got some dirt. Nail is good. Okay, see, I can hear him. Yep. He's, as soon as I'm visible, he's going to bomb me. I hate these things so much. All right, and go. Okay, get out of here. Move, move, move. Because he's probably carrying a rock around with him. Yep, there he is. I hate you so much. I want a sniper rifle in this game just for him. It's just not worth it. I mean, like, oh, but there's a chest at the top. No, it's not worth it. There's nothing I'm going to get in that chest that I care about. All right, so here's the thing. I need to weigh anchor, and I need to head to another island. Because getting a llama is not negotiable. There's no other creatures around here? Sometimes there can be. Oh, well, there wouldn't be any up above there. That's for sure. I've never seen one up there. There's sometimes going to be two down here along with the boar. But, uh, all right, we're out of here. So what I'm going to do is first I'm going to weigh anchor. And then we're going to turn the radar and see what direction I'm going in. All right, I know what direction I'm not going in, and it's that way. All right, so which way is the wind blowing? Oh, the wind is actually helping me here, isn't it? All right. That way. All right, it's a long trip, but if the wind is behind us, it won't be a big deal. I do, however... Oh, I want to turn that off, too. Boom. All right, so how are you doing? Have you eaten? You have eaten. Okay, that's good. You're accepting your lot in life. I'm going to have to make a lot of buckets. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make my way to the next island and I'm going to hope there's going to be a llama there. See, I've run into a bunch of llamas, but when I actually want one, that's when I can't find one. So hopefully this new island will have a llama for us. Well, it took a while, but we are now on another large island. As a matter of fact, this is the location where the two pufferfish and the chests are. I am going to kill them before we leave. However, the most important thing, of course, is getting a animal. And I do believe there's usually one or two running around over there. I'm hoping one of them is going to be a llama, because I really do want to get going with this. All right. And uh, there's nothing dangerous in this area that I'm aware of. So it should just be animals and i think there's you oh except of course there's a boar over here well i mean uh, did i see something else move all right let's just keep our eyes open here 
I mean, I can kill this guy without a lot of trouble. As long as I don't waste my arrows, right? Hey, you. You see me? There we go. Ow! Okay, he gave me a ride. I didn't want to ride. Okay, um... Whoop! Okay, he caught me. Alright, got him. Alright, in the ground. Pick it up. Alright, and let's grab all that sweet, sweet meat and the leather, of course. There we go. I started with 20. I didn't lose any. Alright, so that's good. So let's just, uh... Alright, let's get our uh, net catcher out and see what we can find. There's usually something in this area, but then again, I don't think I've ever seen a boar in that area. As long as I stay away from a screecher, that's all I care about. Now, the thing is that I did do a lot of fishing, and I spent all 20 of the, um, of the, uh, the bait that we got. The thing is that I do believe that he's all the way at the top, so I might just wait until I get another island. Okay, I haven't seen any animals around here. Usually that there's one running around, right? Alright, I probably have to make my way down here. I mean, there's usually one running around over there. But then again, I don't remember there being a boar there either. Usually the boar is in this area. And, of course, up the hill on a ledge. I don't see any animals, though. Now, I do know that there's one at the top, but there's usually one around here, too, isn't there? Okay, and I see the screecher. Alright, just keep my eyes open, because I don't want to get jumped. I mean, if it's not over this ridge here... I am just running into the worst luck. I heard him screech. I heard him screech, which means that he's probably mad. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go up there. I'm going to deal with him. And then we're going to see what's on top. With my luck, it'll be another goat. Oh. Where is he? He's all the way down there. You know what? I don't care. As long as he's dead, that's all that matters. Uh, you know, I really love this game, but if there's one thing that I really can't stand, it's this creature fight. Uh, it is just so tedious. The idea that he takes as much to bring down as a boar is just kind of silly. All right, so let's get all the way to the top. Let's do some business with this individual. And, oh, wait a minute. Is there a boar? Okay, there could be a boar up here too. Because sometimes on this ledge, there is a boar. I don't see any at the moment. Like I said, there could be a boar up here. I'm not seeing any problems, though. Watch, there's one at the top. There's no animal, but there's a boar. And guess what we got here? We got ourselves a llama. It's going to be a long run back, but he's in a small contained area, isn't he? All right, first things first. Let's go get some stuff up here. All right, I don't need to have this out because I don't want to accidentally shoot him. Yeah, watch, there's a boar here. He knocks me off and I fall to my death. It would be so funny. All right, up here, up here, here. I don't even care really about the trees, although that is useful. All right, and I could use a couple of extra watermelon. Yeah, I forgot to bring uh, fluids with me, so I have been eating watermelon. Because watermelon is great for hydration. What do you got? Okay, what did I drop? All right, I have that recipe already. What else is in here? Okay, because I'm going to empty out a lot when I drop these guys off. 
Oh, I didn't bring any of the uh, the tokens up with me, did I? All right. Well, you know, I wouldn't have had space for it anyway. All right. Like I said, I'm just going to ignore the other things at the moment because I'm going to be carrying a llama all the way back down with me. Oh, wow. It's right under there. It's too bad I can't jump. But then again, I think that our friend is going to be terrified enough, right? All right. Let's just... Uh, do some business with this machine up here. Okay, uh, I can grab that. All right, so let's see if we can increase our reputation because I have a lot of these. Oh, wait a minute. Do I have space for a token? Okay, I do now because I could very well be getting tokens and they might just be dropping on the ground, right? Okay, and reputation tier two. So let's just sell the rest of these and then see what we can get. There we go. Okay, bye. And I now have tier two. Okay, advanced fishing bait. I can buy ore, explosive goo. How much is that? I mean, a couple, those things over time will be inexpensive. I'm just seeing, is there anything here? Yeah, you're not gonna fool me with your recipes again. No. Foundation counter? Keeps track of your foundations so you don't have to. I might get one of those. Sounds interesting. It's just I can't do that now, of course. I think the most important thing... I don't have any trash cubes. All right, the next time I hit another island, I'm going to have to do that. Because, um, yeah. I got, the, I got a good number of these. But, I mean, I do need the uh, trash cubes with me, don't I? But you know what I really need? I need a llama. That's what I need. Oh, wait a minute. What do you got in here? Okay. Uh, vegetable stew. I'm already making um, soup, I should say. I'm also already making great use out of that. Okay. You got nowhere to hide here, do you? No, you don't. Where are you? I, I see you. I see you. I see you. Oh. Ooh. Okay. So you and I are going to get to know each other during our long trip down. Um, I am going to tell you my life story. Oh, there's a clucker, too. Ooh, you know, I think that I may have to come back up here again. It is a long trip, though. A very long trip. During our trip, we had a deep uh, conversation. I learned about his uh, uh, wishes in life. Mostly, he wishes he hadn't been captured by me. But, uh, you know, for now, it is a thing, right? I have a friend for you to meet. He doesn't have a name yet, either. I should say she, since I'm going to be getting milk. Um, I'm hoping that you left some grass up here. Okay, we got plenty of grass. And boom, there we go. All right, how are we doing with the grass? Okay, we need some fresh water here, so let's just very quickly do this. Yeah, I'm going to go up for the clucker. I mean, it's in a contained location. Should be pretty easy to get, so we're just going to do that. All right, there we go. Okay, remember to share from this point on, he who does not have a name, and you too, who does not have a name. All right, so what I'm going to do is... I need to drop some stuff here, though. Uh, I'm going all the way back up, but, you know, I'm not going to go all the way up. So I'm going to worry about running into the trader another time. Uh, let me just drop some of these things here because I want to get them out of my inventory. And thank goodness things do not respawn on this island. Oh, I wanted the berries. All right, that'll do. I don't really need to carry a lot of other stuff. All right, so let's get uh, a clucker. You know, the problem is that I have to go all the way around the island because this is all water here. So even though I came down over there and this is closer, I have to go all the way around, which is a little bit annoying. Oh, that reminds me. Yeah, the shovel. All right, I'm going to have to stop in the cave on the way over to dig up some stuff. Then we will go get ourselves a clucker. All right, we're back up the hill here. Oh, there you go. Come on back. Come on back. You have no choice. There you go. Thank you for making it easy. Now, as I um, asked the last fellow, 
So what's your history? What were your hopes and dreams before, of course, uh, all your hopes and dreams were shattered? It's okay if it's a long story. We have a long walk ahead of us. Oh, yes, we do. Oops, that would be a very long walk. Really? That's very interesting. And we're back. And we have our third mate here, don't we? All right, let's see. Wouldn't want to jump in the water now, would we? Nope. There we go. Got some friends for you up above. You're really going to like being at sea. It's something that animals just love, especially when they're land-based, right? Hey, I got a new friend for you guys. Okay, where'd you go? There you are. All right, so it's, it's wonderful, isn't it? Yeah, it will get stormy and you don't have any shelter, but you're going to love it. Uh, that reminds me, I do see that somebody has eaten some stuff here. Hold on a minute. Yeah, I'm going to have to move these. All right, this one over here. And I think that's it for now. All right, so, I mean, you have 12 others to munch on. You shouldn't have any problems. However, there is something I want to get going on immediately. After I dump everything I got in that cave. Yeah, that's actually a really good cave, by the way. Uh, I got eight dirt out of that. And then, of course, I got some mushrooms out of that. And I got some other stuff that I'm going to put over here. As a matter of fact, hold on a moment here. They're not really useful for to, to me as ore, are they? But we'll put that over there, that over there. I should probably start keeping the uh, glass over here because it just makes sense. You know what I mean? And then, of course, we have um, the leather over here. Also, doesn't really make a lot of sense. You know what does make sense, though? Where are those shears? Guess what I got? Oh, Mr. Llama! We need to have a visit! Don't worry, this has nothing to do with your reproductive system. Um, and I got one piece of wool. I don't know, maybe I should grab another llama if I see one in the future. I do have enough room. The first one, of course, is going to be for uh, research. So let's do some research because this is going to unlock some stuff for me. Okay, so we have the leather helmet. We have leather body armor. We have leather grabs. And we have the backpack. That's the first order of business right there, so I can carry more stuff. All right, let's just see here. I believe it's down here. Okay, the backpack. I need rope. I need six wool. Yikes. All right, and then for the hat, I need two wool. For the body armor, I need four. And then for the grebs, I need three. So, yeah, if I do run into another llama... Probably going to have to grab it. Otherwise, uh, that one up there is going to have a really terrible life. Terrible life indeed. Anyway, I think that that is going to be it for now. So we have a full complement there, don't we? And in terms of you, I will be uh, making a bucket very soon. Very soon indeed. What are the crops? Yeah, I'm going to have to... Um, look into a sprinkler system. It's kind of the reason that I was building around. I don't really know the area. I didn't use a sprinkler system in my last playthrough. I just basically did watering. But considering how many plots I'm going to be having here, probably want to consider it. He's like, no, please let me out. I don't belong here. I only have two legs and I have feathers. Hey, you're, you're filling the quota. You're filling the quota. Besides, I expect a lot of cool eggs from you. Apparently, there's some cooking recipes for that. Anyway, that is going to be it for now. So the quest was to get a llama, and we got a llama. We also got a goat, and we got a clucker, too. So we have a full complement. Am I going to get more animals? I think another llama would just be a really good idea. I mean, I'm having no trouble at all getting leather. And let's face it, when I go to Balboa Island, yeah, there's going to be a lot of leather there. A lot of leather. So, uh, yeah, that's going to be a thing. Anyway, that's going to be it for now. If you enjoyed the video, 
please give it a like. Maybe say something in the comments for the Great God algorithm. And of course, subscribing is a great way to show your support. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See ya.